Hey guys, so a new batch of comma mistakes is at your doorstep. Medieval, medieval, alibi, alibi. Be careful with L in the middle. It doesn't get softened. It's not alibi, it's alibi, alibi. Imagine there is a schwa sound between L and B, alibi. British people usually say root. But Americans would most probably say route, route. Hence, we have router and router, router. Agatha Christie, Agatha Christie. The stress is on the first syllable, Agatha Christie. COVID, not COVID, never COVID. It's COVID, COVID. The same sound as you have in go, COVID. Quarantine, qu or teen. Quarantine, not quarantine, not quarantine, not quarantine. Quarantine, quarantine. Maria Sharapova. In English, her name is pronounced differently. The stress is on the third syllable in her last name. Maria Sharapova. Eureka, Eureka. In a stressed second syllable, we have a long E sound as in tree. Eureka, Eureka. A-vitaminosis, A-vitaminosis. The first vowel is always A. In vite or vit, it depends on how you pronounce vitamin or vitamin. So it could be A-vitaminosis or A-vitaminosis, but always A. A-vitaminosis, A-vitaminosis. Acronym. Acronym. In Russian, the stress falls on the second syllable. That's why it's confusing. But it's not acronym. It's acronym. Acronym. Chaos. Chaos. First, we start this word with the K sound. And then we have a diphthong A, followed by a linking Y sound and an open A sound. K, K, chaos. Chaos. Molecule. Molecule. The stress here is also different from Russian. It falls on the first syllable. So it's not molecule, it's molecule. Molecule. Make me happy with your likes, reposts, and comments because your support means the world to me.